Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Absolute Baseball. Five box, random team, number 15. All teams are in, all card ship. It's a random team break. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Appreciate it. And there are the teams right there. And let's roll it and randomize it. One and a four, five times for names and teams. One, two, three, three. There's four and once more, fifth and final time. After five, we got Travis down to Danny. One and a four, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and five. We got the Reds down to the Mariners. All right, Travis with the Red Legs, Chad with the Marlins, Aaron with the Twins, Roy with the Braves, uh, Chad with the Diamondbacks, Jay with the Brew Crew, Chad with the Cubs, Aaron with the Orioles, Chad with the Red Sox, Derek, you got the Pirates, Brent with the Mets, Chad with the White Sox and Astros, Jan with the Nats, Chris with the Yankees, TJ, you got the Dodgers, nice. Aaron with the Giants and Tigers, Dom with the Angels, Nestor with the Rangers, Aaron with the Royals, Travis with the Rockies, Aaron with the Rays, Chad with the A's and Phillies, Alan with the Cardinals, Aaron with the Guardians, Chad with the Blue Jays and Padres, Danny with the M's. 2020, who are the big rookies in 2020? Someone let me know in the chat. Also, we're gonna pause the video. When we come back, we're gonna see if there's any trades and then we'll have that half case break from a fresh case. So stick around, BRB. All right, welcome back everybody. 2020 Panini Absolute Baseball, random team break number 15, no trade, so that list remains the same. TJ was mentioning 2020 should be Gavin Lux, Dustin May, Gonsolin rookie years. Steve Birch saying Luis Robert, Bo Bichette, some of the guys that we should be expecting rookie-wise. There it is, 2020. Half case from a fresh case. Second half in the store right now, so if you want to run this back, we definitely can. And this first half, by the way, is part of the promo. Second half is not. But still a great break that we can do. Definitely would be happy to run this back tonight. So the five on the back row right here, you can see on the top camera as well. One, two, three on the dice roll. And the this row right here, four, five, six on the dice roll. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. So we'll go that side, and then this side we will save for break, this is break 15, this will save for break 16. So we'll mark those 16 right there so we all know they're from the same case. First box, good luck. So what are we looking for here? We're looking for four autographs and two memorabilia cards per box on average. Good luck. We got Yankees at Guardians on the on the, my TV up there. You can see my, my eyes dart that way. That's that's what I'm looking at, but Yankees up 4-2, top of the seventh. The Yankees trying to tie things up. Cleveland leads, leads the series 2-1. Cleveland trying to move on and face the uh, Astros in the CS. All right, so are there hits on the bottom? Is there a base card on the bottom? There's a card on the bottom. There's two cards on the bottom right here. I think 
Let's use this blank card right there to cover that up. All right, here we go. An all card ship. Is Yasmani Grandal to 199 for the White Sox. It'll be for Chad. And the hits, we've got Tools of the Trade, Triple Relic. It's Ryan O'Hearn, 24 out of 49 for the Royals. Aaron with Kansas City. Tools of the Trade, Kevin Biggio. Nice, 48 out of 49. Six piece relic and autograph. It'll be for Chad and the Blue Jays. And then we've got a Davy Gruyon. 101 out of 149 uh, for the Phillies. That's going to be for Chad as well. We got Josh Bell, it's 92 out of 199, Pirates Edition, going to Derek. And we've got Hallbound, each Euro, piece of his jersey, Danny with Seattle. We got Jonathan Hernandez for Texas, 13 out of 99. It's for Nestor and the Rangers. And we've got Gavin Lux, 17 out of 25. Rookie Gavin Lux, gold ink auto on the black and yellow baseball. That's pretty cool. And that'll be for TJ and the Dodgers. Pretty solid season for Gavin Lux this year. He took a big step forward. All right, next box. I think this year was kind of a big year for Gavin Lux going into the season. I think they were thinking in spring training, this is kind of a kind of a make or break year for Gavin Lux. Is he gonna be, you know, an everyday guy or is he gonna be an off the bench kind of guy? Or is he gonna even be with the Dodgers, you know? There was a thought that with the, all the Dodgers prospects that he could be, um, as they say, surplus to your requirements. But end of the season with a 276 batting average, 116 hits, handful of homers, six homers, 42 RBIs, seven stolen bases, an OPS of 745. Overall war wins above replacement, two and a half, 2.5. 20 doubles, seven triples. I think league leading seven triples. All right, 56 out of 99, Cal Ripken. And we've got to stand the man Musial. 76 out of 99 for the Cardinals, that's for Allen. And Aaron with the Orioles. And your hits, Josh Rojas, rookie materials, 98 out of 99 for Chad and the Snakes. Evax could have They've got an interesting crop of youngsters coming up the ranks. There's another Cavan Biggio, this time out of 199. The other one was, what was the other one? The other one was out of 49. This one's out of 199. It's another one for Chad and the Blue Jays. Interestingly, this feels like this needs to go into a thicker top.
All right, and then we got Matt Tice, 10 out of 125. And that will be for Dom and the Halos. There's the Babe, and there's Justin Verlander, 148 out of 149 for Chad and the Astros. We have Hallbound materials, Clayton Kershaw, 37 out of 49. Be interesting to see what Kershaw does. I think he's only on a one-year deal with the Dodgers, which is now is now ended. It's for TJ and the Dodgers. Thirty-five out of one twenty-five. Jonathan Hernandez. Does he end up here in Texas? Just to kind of close out his career. Nestor with the Rangers. I guess that would be the big news of the offseason for the Dodgers. Ooh. Wow. What a time to get this. For the Astros. Jordan Alvarez. One of one autograph. Rookie Jordan Alvarez. Wow. Wow. That's right, Ben. That's pretty awesome. And that's Chad Cromwell, who got randomized the Astros in this break. Out of fives and under, get the train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Not the guy Mariners fans want to see right now, but hey, hashtag good for the hobby. That's pretty awesome. Next box. No, no other reactions, huh? I guess everyone's watching Sunday Night Football. Or this Yankees-Cleveland game. I'm sure once that ends up on social media, people are going to be like, what? When'd you pull that? And we've got a David Dahl for the Rockies to 199. That'll be for Travis. There's another Jordan Alvarez introductions. We got rookie material, some nice color there. 9 out of 25, Jonathan Hernandez, Nestor, and the Rangers. We got Andy Pettit. Uh, 10 out of 49. We got a bit of the Yankee pinstripe in there and his autograph. Chris Parent with the Yankees. Absolute heroes. Then back here is uh, Tyrone Taylor, 32 S75 rookie autograph for the Brew Crew. It's going to be for Jay. Big fan of the Absolute using the piece of leather, leather put some stitching on there. It's a nice little design. And we got another Yasmani Grandal to 199. 
And back here we got Dual Relic Team Tandem Materials. Nolan Arenado, Trevor Story. Old Rockies going to Travis and the Rocks. Does not look like this is numbered. Am I missing a number somewhere? No, not numbered, but still goes to you. Absolute Heroes. That's another Andy Pettit. This time out of 10. Better patch, nice gold color, and an autograph. Another Yankee for Chris Parent. And back here is Dylan Cease. Rookie autograph. 34 out of 125. White Sox. Chad. box right over there. Good luck everyone. I thought that was a redemption, but maybe that's just a thin card there. So we'll find out in a second. That's Bo Bichette. And a Vlad Guerrero Jr., 54 out of 99. Blue Jays for Chad. And we've got Brendan McKay, rookie materials. For the Rays, Aaron Miller in Tampa Bay. I think injuries kind of delaying Brendan McKay's sort of debut. Not, maybe not debut, but just delaying him, his progression. 34 out of 99. Kyle Lewis, two color, dual relic, and autograph. Mariners, Danny, with the M's. Disappointing end, but a really nice season for the Mariners. They can keep building on that. And we got Don Sutton, 32 out of 50. And that is uh, is California Angels version of Don Sutton. I don't remember. I remember Dodgers Don Sutton. But uh, yeah, looks like he had a few seasons with the Angels towards the end of his career. So that goes to Dom with the Halos. Got an Alex Bregman, 61 out of 99 for the Astros. Chad. Got a, got a rookie materials, Gavin Lux for TJ and the Dodgers. The thin card was Ramon Laureano, Absolute Inc. 12 out of 99 for the Oakland A's. Chad with the Athletics. And back here is Sheldon Noisy, 67 out of 125, another athletic for Chad. All right, fifth and final box. The second half is in the store right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com if you want to run this back. Pretty quick break, pretty fun break. A lot of big hit possibilities. A little blast from the past a couple years ago. And uh, 40 bucks for a random team, half case break, that's not a bad price point. All right, 
Thanks, everybody. And good luck. Got a Joey Gallo, 90 out of 99. Still Rangers edition here. Nestor with Texas. We got Shun Yamaguchi for Chad and the Orioles. Orioles? Rays. Rays? Jays. It's pretty much named every other bird team except for the Blue Jays. What do you got? Jordan Yamamoto, 23 out of 149. Quad Relic and Autograph for Chad and the Marlins. I guess Rays aren't a bird team. But you get it. And that's the big hurt. Two out of ten. Gold ink autograph. Right on the piece of the baseball. White Sox? Chad Cromwell with the White Sox. Nice. And trust me, Chad. She'll like it too. All right, last mini box. Good luck. We got Ronald Acuna Jr. 52 out of 99 for the ATL. And your hits, we have a Gavin Lux. Got a piece of his lumber right here, some pieces of his jersey, 88 out of 99. For TJ and the Dodgers. Not too shabby. Got another thin card here. That's Nomar Mazzara. Four out of 99. Absolute Inc. Chicago White Sox. That's for Chad. And the last one here is Yu Chang. 42 out of 50 for Cleveland. That's Aaron Miller and the Guardians. The uh, Cleveland Guardians trying to close things out tonight and advance to the next round. But Yankees, I think, are still in the lead. Aaron Miller. Cleveland, this is for you. And there you have it, boys and girls. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.